Let's see how to analyze a connection and configure the design options in Cyp Connect. To do this, once the node has been created, we select it in the table on the left-hand side of the interface and edit the connection by clicking on the corresponding button at the top. In the connection pop-up window, if the model of the connection is already complete, we go to the analysis tab. Here, we configure the load cases and loads acting on each section by using the options in the top toolbar. We can also generate the cases and loads automatically using Generate from the BIM model. With the following button, we set the design options. First, in the discretization section, we type in the maximum size of the element. This value refers to the side of the triangular finite elements with which the program performs the discretization of the sections and plates. By using a value between 30 and 50 mm, we obtain good results with reasonable analysis times. Then, in the welds section, we can modify the length to calculate the average stresses. There are normally stress concentrations at the end of the weld, where the values are usually higher than in the rest of the weld. If this is the case, increasing the length reduces the average stress. In the multi-process analysis section, we can configure the analysis method that the program uses to determine the maximum number of instances that the OpenSeas engine will use to carry out the analysis. The automatic method tries to maximize the computer's capacity by launching as many instances as possible, whereas if we choose sequential, we must type in the maximum number of OpenSeas instances. The Help button on the right-hand side provides more information on these methods. To confirm the changes, we click on Accept. Finally, we click on the Stress Deformed Shape option to carry out the force analysis and the checking of the connection elements. Also, if we wish to analyse the rotational stiffness of selected bars, we can carry out this analysis by clicking on the option with the same name. The first time the analysis is run, the implemented OpenSeas version is automatically installed. If it is already installed, the analysis will be carried out. If we have several processes, the program will be able to analyse several load cases at the same time. Once completed, we can consult the results offered by the program in order to continue our work.